Dwayne Johnson. What are you running for, my friend? I am running for County Commission District 5, Burnley Hill County Commission right here. Okay, that's up in the uh, the eastern part of the, uh, of the yeah, county, yes? It's the eastern part of the county. It's basically East Albuquerque, um, East Mountains. Very good. That's the district I live in. Ah, well then we will talk. Okay, I'm watching you. <laughs> well, good. You so should be watching you, all of us, have actually. You, have you been in politics before? Are you a political hack? I am not a political hack. Okay. I have run before. There's uh, my, my dirty little secret is I ran for office before and lost, um, unfortunately. But for the same reasons that I'm running today. Um, in fact, which are, are I mean, probably what, so a lot stronger than you going here? Be. Well, I think everybody has been appalled by spending. And I always have. Governments spend money like it's theirs. And in all honesty, it's not. And it never has been their money. And I tell people this all the time. The biggest problem with government is, or different layers of government, you know when, when you've got uh, the state taking your $230 million in new taxes. It's, it's reported. They're like muggers. They come beat you up, take your money, and you know your money's gone. Or soon will be. But you can't call the cops because they are the cops. They, exactly. Yeah. But you start looking at other levels of government, like your school boards, your city councils, your county commissions, they're a little bit more like uh, pickpockets. They steal your money in smaller amounts, and you don't really realize it's gone until you look in your wallet and all you've got is lint. And we need good people at every level of government that understand that government isn't the solution to things. And too much government leads to too much corruption, leads to bad ethics, leads to too much spending. People that will say, smaller government is better. And smaller government, what does that lead to? A little thing we call freedom. If we don't have freedom, we don't have anything. And we shouldn't have government that's taking our freedom by taking our money, by taking our choice. It is the same thing. If you don't have money, you don't have time, you don't have freedom. That's right. Yeah. Fruits and money is are freedom. stolen. M money is freedom. It you is. work for that money. It's it yours. It shouldn't be government. And they shouldn't think of it as theirs. The, the revenue pr projections for... They, they look at taxes as revenue. And they're the only... Do you know of any business that can actually go out there and force you to buy the product, whether or not you even want it in the first place? Government can do that. Well, very few businesses have their own army and IRS to collect the money. That, that's a good point. Well, maybe yes. we're in the wrong business. And businesses, small businesses, and while well, businesses in general, do fail, unless, of course, they're too big to fail. That's right. They but can't print their own money, usually. Exactly. And understand. they should fail. If, if the public doesn't want what they have, or their service gets so bad, or they get so arrogant, the market punishes them by running them out of the market. I think they call it free market economics. It's very simple. And we usually win, don't we? The consumers, when the, the consumers free market operates. generally win. Exactly. Wonderful. Well, Wayne, I look forward to seeing you uh, run for uh, county commission in my part of town. Good luck to you. Well, thank you. And I want your card because I want to be able to call you. Give me your cell I, phone. I will give you. I will give you my cell phone number. Okay. My card. I'm putting it on tape. I don't care. Wonderful. Put it on tape. Well, three no, seven. I, no, I it's, want it. I it's three seven nine seven five four zero. Thanks, Wayne.